hello well, welcome to the start of this vlog look who's here i just started to film and bestie cat walked in he hasn't been on he hasn't been on anything for ages have you youtube or instagram bestie cat hello hello <laughs> he's really enjoyed being held recently i don't know do cats go through stages of loving being held and then sometimes they don't but yeah you he really enjoys it you pick him up and he just stays with you so here's Bestie Cat to say hello. Rufus is just outside, Rufus the dog. So welcome to the start of this video. I hope you're okay and sending lots of love to you. So this is gonna be a come shopping with me vlog. So we're gonna go to some charity shops and maybe some normal shops as well, but I think pretty much, I really fancy just having a look in charity shops. I've also got to donate quite a lot. So I shall be dropping off some um, bags of stuff to charity shops because I've had a really good declutter and um, my wardrobe, oh, I think he's going now. Are you going? Are you staying? Oh, he's just on my lap. Oh, got a tail in my face. Um, so yeah, my wardrobe here is clear. I haven't seen the bottom of it for a long time. And I was messing about the other day and I started pulling a few things out and then I got more and more. So um, yeah, I've had a really good declutter. And before I carry on, I've got to do my mug of the day and it is this lovely Kathy Kidston one. It's so pretty. It's got little, are they otters or seals? and owls and deer it's like a badger i think the colors are really pretty sort of grays pinks and greens really nice nice sizes these kath kidson mugs i've got a fruit tea and this is my mug of the day so before we go shopping i just need to let you know that this part of the video is sponsored so it's a collaboration with emma mattress and i did do another collaboration with the emma mattress in september and we were sent a mattress to try on our bed and it and it's great like the mattress is so comfortable probably had some of the best night's sleep ever i love it lee loves it there's no complaints we're really impressed with the quality it supports you and it's nice and firm but it's soft as well it's just perfect and i love it so when they got back in touch and said would i like to work with them again i said yes please because toby's been after a new mattress so he keeps going on our bed saying oh this is really comfortable i want i want a mattress like this um so we needed to get him a new mattress anyway so the timing was perfect and he now has his own emma mattress so i pre-filmed it comes in a box you probably know this but just in case you don't all the mattresses arrive in boxes so they're really easy to kind of move around so i'll show you the mattress in a box so this is the Emma Premium mattress. So I'm going to take it out of here and then put it on Toby's bed. Well, I'm just in Toby's bedroom. So this is his mattress, the brand new Emma mattress. As you can see, just wanted to show you in a bit more detail. And I love the fact it's got this zip part as well. So if you get any spills or any um, anything like that, you can just put it in the washing machine. So yeah, that's the mattress. So if you have been looking for a new mattress for yourself or, or someone you know, or a family member, you can actually try the Emma one for 200 nights. You get a risk-free trial, so you can try it and see how you get on. And they've also got a huge sale on at the moment, up to 50% off. And I've got a special code, it's McCabe, and you'll get a further 5% off and you get a 10 year guarantee as well. So all the details will be linked below if you want to find out some more information about Emma Mattress. And I'm gonna carry on this vlog tomorrow morning. So I'm gonna to head to the charity shops in the morning. I just thought, you know, I would start the vlog off here, say a quick hello, show you Toby's mattress and how it arrived. And then yeah, head out tomorrow morning to some charity shops, but I hope you're okay. I'm sending lots of love to you and I shall speak to you in the morning. Good morning, it's nine o'clock and I've just dropped Toby off to school. And I'm gonna be heading out to have a look around a couple of charity shops in a little village near me called Stalham, which is in Norfolk. And they've got three or four really good charity shops and they're normally reasonably priced as well. So I'll go and have a look around those and I shall do some filming. I've also got to donate these big bags behind me because like I said earlier on in the vlog, I've had a massive declutter. So there's tons of clothes and things in, in those bags. So I'm gonna be sending those off to charity. And I also managed to do even more decluttering. I got rid of a load of um, boots and shoes which is great because they take up so much room don't they you don't realize they were just like stuffed in the corner of my other wardrobe so I've managed to go through those and yeah so I'm going to be taking those off the charity shop later on so I've just got those bags with me so I shall uh I'm on my way I'll uh film when I get there obviously I've got my emergency banana I've got a big thing of water and hopefully we'll find some bargains and I've just got to Stalham and I'm going to head down here and go to the Priscilla Bacon charity shop I'll just start off and have a look outside here. Oh, 
lovely little bundle of books there, vintage books. And I've just seen Rufus, he does that exact pose with his paws. So there's nice photo frames here. There's actually loads, it's quite a small charity shop, but there's so much in here. Oh, that's nice up there. And I managed to find a couple of things, a dress and two tops. They were a pound each, the tops, so I'll show you them uh, either in the car or when I get home. So I'm just gonna go up here and there's a really good brake charity shop just a bit further up. So I'm going to have a look in here, brake charity shop, it's quite a big one. There's a, another section like in that part as well. And then further along the road, there's a Sue Rider and I think it's an RSPCA, yeah, RSPCA, just there by the post office. So I'll just go to those and we'll see, see what's inside. Go in here first. Oh look, there's a Candy Crush board game, £2.50. I've never actually played that, I know that was like really popular a few years ago. Puzzles, chicken and chips bucket. I've got loads of books in here. It's always worth having a look um, where the fabrics are, they have some really nice um, blankets and... Uh, Bed sheets, things that you know have hardly been been used, and I've got some lovely fabric actually that I've used for a few different things. Cute cards, so pretty Little cards. Some little cushions in here. This one looks pretty. Hang on. There's a little one down here. That's pretty. Little ruffles on it. Oh. Oh, hello. How much is this? One pound. That side's really pretty though. Hang on. Stay there. I do love these um, ruffles. Oh, oh, sorry. Cushion. Hang on. Stay there. There you go. That's so pretty. Oh, oh, sorry, Cushion. I'm chucking you about. <laughs> Coming here and throwing things around. Okay, put it there. That is pretty, isn't it? A pound. Oh, it's lovely. Maybe someone else. I'll leave it for someone else to find. They might love a panda. It's a panda, isn't it? Probably to ages to do. Is that? How's that been stuck on there? I don't know. A lot of work's gone into that. It's very pretty. I'll leave it there. Just having a look at the books. I've read that one, The Language of Kindness. It was really good, so I recommend that. I just sort of thought, oh, I remember reading that after Mum passed away. I read it, and it's just what I needed. Got loads of books here. Lee's mum would probably love that. <laughs> she loves things like this. What else is up there? Can you walk down the hall and say, Oh, magic, it's great. And four pound of diamonds, please, sweetheart. Thank you very much. Thank you for your mum, day. Mum, mum is That's nice. Oh, yeah. It's really nice that um, cake stand. 
It's quite nice as well. Oh, so they're getting ready for Mother's Day with this section here, which is good, isn't it? This is lovely. It's, um, it says mouth blown glass. It's five pounds. I thought it was a vase at first, but you lift it up and it's got a wooden base. So they for a candle. It's really nice, isn't it? Hmm, that must be for a candle then. These are also very sweet, these little dishes. They're two pounds and they're in the shape of little flowers. So it's two pounds for the four. They're very sweet. My mum used to have loads of this stuff, this china. So there's some really nice things here. What's that? A telephone. Is that just a, for show? Funny pig. Here. <laughs> that mirror is quite nice, like an outdoor mirror, little butterflies on metal, £3.50, that's good. So I think this one's shut, I just saw some ladies just tried the door, so it says it opens 10am, but might be, oh no, back on Tuesday. Today is Wednesday, isn't it? Yeah. Oh. Okay, so I guess they're closed. So I'll go up here to the RSPCA charity shop, which is just over here. And they're really nice in this one. The guy who runs it's really lovely and chatty. It's quite nice, little jacket. Today, like for around the house, <laughs> ninety nine. I like them. That's nice. It's a Laura Ashley diffuser. Five pounds. I've just come to Lidl, so I want to get some tulips, and I need a few, a few things. And look how pretty the little plants are outside. I've, I've bought quite a lot of these actually, these little primrose plants. They're just so pretty. Oh, look at these. Lavender, three pack, £4.29. And some other aromatic herbs down here. And some little trees, Italian herb tree, £5.99. one of those the other day, one of those little indoor plants. And some tulips. I'm back from Lidl, I got some tulips, some pink ones, and two bunches of these lovely, sort of ready pinky ones. And I thought they were all um, reduced, but only two of them were. So £1.57, oh, Ruth's just having a drink. <laughs> £1.57 for the two, and then this one's were two twenty-five. So three bunches of tulips. I got some ready meals, some spaghetti bolognese, and they were reduced to one pound eighty-eight. So they're just handy to have, aren't they? Just going to shove them in the freezer. Uh, some drinks for Toby's pat lunches. So some tropical drinks. I think they had some money off, and some yogurts for pat lunches, and all this coffee because it had ten percent off. And I really like these coffee pods. They're um, probably the best value and really nice coffee. They had 10% off, so they were down to two pounds, roughly two pound 50 for 20 pods, which is brilliant. And I got some bananas, some smoked ham, tomatoes, and a cucumber, because I'd heard there was a bit of a 
shortage. So I didn't expect to see cucumbers and tomatoes, but they had them in Lidl and they were they were reduced as well. Um, not reduced, sorry, on offer. So I grabbed those. Um, so this is everything. And then when I went to pay, it came to £30. And the lady said there was a coupon for a fiver off. So she um, showed me where the coupon was on the app. It's kind of, if you have a look on the Money Saver website, it says on there. So you get £5 off if you spend, yeah, £30 or more. So I used that. So I got everything for £25, which is brilliant for all this coffee and tulips and stuff so i'm gonna put it in the fridge and look who's here hello rufus how are you would you like sit yes would you yes would i haven't even asked the question oh it's not a would you like it's a do you want isn't it do you want a do you want a gravy bone i think the answer was yes <laughs> he's just enjoying his gravy bone do you love that Oh, Rufy Doofies. Rufus, was that nice? Was that a nice gravy bone? Oh, <laughs> who's a good boy? Come here. Come here. Oh, I love you, Rufy Doofs. Hello, gorgeous dog. He's back on the vlog. Oh, sweetest little soul ever you are. Who's a good boy? <laughs> I've just put the tulips in a vase. I put them all in together. So I think after they've had a good old drink, they'll perk up a bit. And I've just made a coffee in this cute little mug. It's a Sophie Allport mug. I uh, love the color. It's kind of, I think it's taupe with little pears on it. It's gorgeous. So another mug of the day. That was a little coffee. And I got this dress this morning from the charity shop. So it's from Wallace originally. And it was £5.95 from Priscilla Bacon. I just thought it was really pretty. It's a size 10 but it's sort of stretchy jersey material, so I'm pretty sure it's gonna fit. It looked like it had quite a bit of give. It looked like a 12 to me, you know, you just tell by sizes, can't you? So hopefully that'll fit. And it's quite long, so I think it's kind of past the knee. Really pretty though, I love the little belt there. And I think dresses like this are just so easy to wear. So a really pretty um, little dress. 5.95 and then I got a couple of bargains that were a pound so I'll just show you them. There was a one pound sale rail section and I found these two tops. Um, well one's a jumper, one's a top. This is a warehouse. It's a, oh, it was a size 10. The sleeves are kind of t-shirt material and this is silky at the front with a little bit of lace at the bottom. So this is really nice. If it doesn't fit me, I think my friend Mandy is gonna love this. She wears kind of blousy tops. And that's the back, so it's just, again, T-shirt material. So it's, I thought it was lovely. A nice little detail with the lace at the bottom. And this jump, oh no, I've just, oh, I just chucked something in the coffee. What just happened? Oh well, it needs to be washed anyway. Um, and then this jumper was a pound. So I just thought it was really cute. So it's from Papaya, which is Matalan, isn't it? So one pound for this little blue jumper with polka dots. It's a size small, but it looks like a, about a 12 to me so yeah I love little polka dot tops I love the colour and it feels quite nice and warm and it's in good condition so I grabbed that as well so a couple of tops and one that now smells of coffee but that's fine I'm just going to drink my coffee and warm up it's so cold outside today I kind of underestimated the weather it's freezing my little nose is cold so I'm going to drink this and warm up and then head to I'll probably go to the massive charity shop in the retail park in Great Yarmouth, the Cancer Research, and have a look around there. I've got some more stuff to grab and donate. And then, yeah, I'll film around there and see what they have and if we can find any more bargains. I was just on the way to the charity shop and I walked past the range and saw all this. So I thought I'd just come in and show you all their spring decor and their Easter decorations. It's so sweet. I love these giant tulips. I looked at these last time I was here. They're only um they're 199 each. Which is really good, isn't it? So pretty. I've got a bunny just like that, but it's um a bit darker. So I can get that out soon. These are really pretty. The prices are so good as well. I think it's £2.50 for that sign. Candles are nice. It's really sweet too. Oh, it is the, this way. <laughs> 2 
Uh -huh. Thank you. The prices are so good, aren't they? Oh, that's really nice, that little sign. two pounds which is brilliant isn't it i love the colors really good price as i went past it looks so pretty oh look over here as well well they look quite realistic these ones i don't know they look really good I really like these. They look so realistic. White pom pom stem. One ninety nine. It's really nice. I've got that. I one just like it from here actually. They're nice too. Two fifty nine. They look realistic as well, don't they? Love those flowers. The pom pom ones. I might have to go back and get some. Right, I'm going to go into... Cancer Research UK. Have a look round here. Start at the dresses and then, um, then make my way along. All the dresses are three pounds each here. I think, yeah, most of the clothes as well, no more than three pounds. What's this one? That's pretty. From next. I like the sleeves. Oh, everything's three pounds. I think they used to have different prices. I'm going to go and look at the home section now, which is over here. Look at those. They're quite nice, aren't they? What do they? Be nice if you had a conservatory or something. Nice for a garden room, maybe. I don't know. It's pretty. Little tea set. I think it's fifteen pounds. Wade, Wade, England. Very pretty. Kids section over there, so I'll have a look in a minute. I want to look some books for Lee as well. I love looking on these shelves. These have tons of glasses. Oh, those are, oh, they're pretty. How lovely are they for Christmas? Only three pounds as well. Like a TK Maxi thing. Oh yeah, they were a TK Max item. Look at that. Oh, what for you? Ah, oh, look cute. That's nice. That's really lovely. I might have to get that and grow some little bulbs in there. It's not a make or anything, but that's it's really lovely. I'll hold, on, I'll hold on to that. Very. It's a football. Let's have a look at that. Toby might appreciate that. <laughs> He's got a pump to blow it up. So yeah, I'll get that for him. Oh, Spain football. Oh, that's pretty little cake standing. It's quite nice. Coleman's mustard. There's so much here. May your coffee be strong and your lashes be long. It's a nice mug as well. Some teapots. 
that's really nice. I think I've scanned most of this wall. Let's have a look around. Oh, what's this one? Something here. Some more expensive gold ticket items there. Uh, what's here? Well, like, massive. Oh, I thought it was a teapot. Some kind of dish thing. That's all of the homeware done. So I'm now gonna head over to the books and the kids section. Pretty. Lots of nice tea sets here. Oh, we've got him. <laughs> right, I'm going to look through these books. Um, Lee is after a couple, so I'm going to see if they have the books he reads. And these are all two for a pound. Oh, I like this. I like this author, Lisa Jewell. I haven't got that actually. I love that shop. You can always find things, and I think this is just gorgeous. This little is it? Are they bluebells or? muscari is that what they're called or hyacinths i don't know but there's some kind of spring flower i think in this kind of is it a utensil pot or just a plant pot it's just a pot for anything really it's really cute i love the color looks kind of i don't think it's very old or anything but i just really liked it so i got that for two pounds i got a couple of other bits as well and i'm gonna keep the other things for a charity shop haul i didn't find loads just maybe a couple of books games and yeah a few a few different things so i shall show you those in a haul maybe next week or the week after that so that is the end of this video i really hope you enjoyed it if you did make sure you give it a like and subscribe as well if you haven't subscribed already and i shall link in the in the description box all the emma mattress details in case you want some more information and remember the um the discounts have got the sale and then there's the extra five percent discount with my code mccabe so if you are looking for a mattress all the details will be linked below with my instagram account things and videos that i filmed recently but have a lovely weekend enjoy the rest of your day and I shall speak to you next Friday at two o'clock. I think it's either going to be a Poundland video, a charity shop haul, or maybe I did think of doing a um, secondhand shopping tips video with some of my favourite finds. So I might do that at some point in the next couple of weeks as well. But there, yeah, there'll be a video next week. Come over to Instagram as well. Like I said, there'll be a link down there, but it's Kate McCabe for my normal account and Kate's Georgian Home for my house account. Thank you so much for watching. I'll speak to you next week. Take care and I'll see you soon. Thanks for staying to the end as, as well. I really appreciate it. Bye bye.